madalas na malikhain at matatalino ang mga Pilipino. Sa katunayan, maraming Pilipino ang naging tanyag sa larangan ng sining. Di lamang sa Pilipinas, maging sa iba't ibang panig ng mundo, ang Metropolitan Museum of Manila o MET ay isa lamang sa mga museo na matatagpuan sa Kamaynilaan. Ito ay naitatag noong 1976 at mga orihinal na likhang sini ang pinapakita nito mula sa iba't ibang bansa. Magmula noong 1993, ang MET ay nagbibigay serbisyo sa pamamagitan ng pag-e-exhibit at pag-aassist ng iba't ibang exhibition ng mga likhang Pilipino. Sinusuportahan nito at tinutulungan na maipakilala at maitampok ang mga gawa nito. Magmula noong 1993, ang MET ay nagbibigay serbisyo sa pamamagitan ng pag-e-exhibit at pag-aassist ng iba't ibang exhibition ng mga likhang Pilipino. Sinusuportahan nito at tinutulungan na maipakilala at maitampok ang mga gawa nito. Sa kasalukuyan, patuloy rin ang pag-exhibit mula sa sarili nitong collection of contemporary art and ecclesiastic art, master paintings, decorative art, pre-Hispanic gold and pottery mula sa Bangko Sentral ng Pilipinas. Ang iba't ibang likhang sining mula sa private and institution leaders ay inyayos din. Bagamat di lahat ay naipakalat o nahanap, mayroon pa rin ito sa mga publication ng MET. Naipakalap din ang trainings para sa teachers art classes para naman sa mga bata, workshops, career talks, at mga programa na hanggang sa ngayon ay isinasagawa para sa paglinang ng sining sa bawat Pilipino. Ako si Jean Kipper Lustica at approve sa amin ang museo na ito. And welcome back sa ating palatuntunan, sa ating muntintahan na na-approve at uh, ang ating kasama ngayon, uh, I'm very pleased to introduce Ms. Dina Kolaiko, President and Board of Trustee ng Metropolitan Museum of Manila. Ma'am, magandang hapon. Magandang hapon, Elaine. Kamusta po kayo? Kabuti. Okay, the Metropolitan Museum of Manila. Could you tell me a little bit of uh, how and when it was established and what was the purpose? The The Metropolitan Museum of Manila was first established in 1976 mm -hmm. as a museum that would show foreign exhibitions. Okay. And then in the 1980s, they began to show uh, Filipino exhibitions mm -hmm. in, <clears throat> during which they began a bilingual approach. Okay. You know, in explaining the exhibitions and making people understand what uh, uh, the shows were all about. Okay. You know? And uh, so we had the... Uh, And then we we also adopted a philosophy of art for all. Okay, and this is still I love that. essentially yes. essentially what uh, we always go <coughs> with whenever we, you know, especially this year when we are moving into a new direction, mm -hmm. focusing on Philippine contemporary art. Okay, uh, kanina in a conversation with a good friend of mine, you know, uh, we were discussing the very the very uh, subject na uh, you mentioned a while ago. You. Uh, art para sa lahat. Kasi merong misconception na um, ang tawag dito, ang art ay para lamang doon sa mga nakakaalam at uh, doon sa mga na, may, may edukasyon, doon sa mga pwedeng bumili ng art. And this is not true at all, is it? No, it is not. <laughs> definitely not. No? And we would like to be able to engage the whole, you know, all sectors of the public, young yeah. and old, people from different disciplines and from all walks of life. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is exactly what we want to draw when uh, with our programs we have educational modules, mm -hmm. we have um, book launches, okay. and uh, we have permanent exhibitions. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We have the gold exhibition, uh, which belongs, the collection of which belongs to the Banco Central of Filipinas. So yung ating uh, Uh, tawag dito, yung collection of, of, of coins uh, from long ago. That's okay. right. Very, very valuable. Pre-colonial. Pre-colonial. Pre yes. okay. And then, um, in a few days, we will be launching another permanent exhibition on Philippine contemporary art. Wow. Okay, what this is, is it's a survey uh -huh. of where Philippine contemporary art took off uh -huh. from the 1920s up to the present so that we see emerging art forms, emerging expressions. Right. Meron tayong pag-uusapan kasi meron din binanggit before na merong programa kayo na although you still uh, did exhibition, foreign exhibits, no, tinapatan natin ito ng the same era ng Philippine art din naman. Marami pa tayong pagkukwento. Okay, alis magbabalik po ang approve. 